Good morning, you're just in time for the news around Uganda. My name is Sachi Sachi. To kickstart us off, we are in Hwema district where there is concern following cholera and malaria outbreak in the area. Now the area authorities say that this follows an influx of refugees in the area. They are calling for more help to help them curb the situation. In more news coming in from northern Uganda, government plans to avail more medication to the area. This is in the areas of Kitugum, Pader and Omoro. The disease burden stands at 806 in Pader, 554 in Kitugum and 339 patients in Lamor. In Gulu there are 323 patients. I hope you have already gotten yourself a copy of today's new vision. We are already looking at the police shuffles, where we could say the whole week has been witnessed by several shuffles. Uh, we can see here the deputy police spokesperson is back, that is Patrick Onyango. So get yourself a copy of today's new vision. In today's exciting pullouts, there is Mualimu. We are talking about how teenage moms are returning back to school. You want to read all those exciting stories. And for the children, in today's new vision, there is the Toto magazine. Make sure that they get a chance to read all these exciting stories. Don't miss the sports pages. We have so many colorful pictures there of how Ugandans got a chance to see the World Cup. There's an interesting picture here of the Uganda Cranes coach, well, taking a selfie with his wife. Make sure you get today's copy of the new vision. Well, coming back to the news of today in Kabale, at the Kabale Institute of Health Sciences, it has remained closed following a strike that happened yesterday. The students were striking over poor services at the Health Institute. We crown up our news with news coming in from Gaza. Missing Sharon has been found after she went missing for days. Uh, she cited mistreatment from her relatives and she was found in Kabubu in Gaza. Currently, she is at Gaza police station awaiting to be reunited to her family. That's all we could make time for. Follow us on Facebook and YouTube or go to www.newvision.co.ug for more stories. I'm Sachi Sache and you have been watching Around Uganda.